Shalom. All praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, and peace and blessings to the elect. It says Russia and India ditching U.S. dollar in defense deals. Moscow and Delhi are seeking to bypass U.S. sanctions by using the rupee, or rupee, and the rubble in facilitating military deals, according to Indian Daily, the, uh, the Economic Times. Now, if you notice, almost every article that comes out is about either one of these countries ditching the dollar, moving away from the dollar, in a trade deal against uh, uh, the dollar, in tariffs against it's always what? Against the dollar. All right? And that's why a, 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 um, a global crash, a stock market crash, all right, is amongst one of the biggest fears, all right, right now, even above that of natural disasters. Okay? Says the paper reports that U.S. sanctions are hampering two bit, and really the U.S. is bringing it upon themselves. All right, um, hampering two, are hampering two billion dollars in defense deals between Russia and India, as payments are getting stuck. The countries are seeking to avoid this by switching to settlements in domestic currencies and ditching the greenback. Ah, look at that. India and Iran drop dollar in oil trade to bypass U.S. sanctions. You see, because with all these sanctions that the U.S. put on these countries, the U.S. thinks that these countries are just going to sit down and take that. No, they're going to find another way. And, and, and the way which they're going now is affecting the U.S. even more because now they're not... If the U.S. says you can't use our money to do this and that because of these sanctions, they're just going to be like, we're not going to deal with your, your currency then. All right. So India and Iran dropped the dollar in oil trade. And now uh, India and Russia are ditching the dollar in defense deals. OK, says India is one of the largest buyers of military equipment from Russia. Since the 1960s, the countries have been uh, have signed military contracts worth sixty five billion dollars. Now, trade deals between the countries are estimated at $12 billion. India is ready to, pur uh, to purchase Russia's S-400 air defense system in a $5 billion deal. Now, Turkey was also um, uh, trying to purchase that, but the U.S. were, were uh, causing problems for them too. Okay. However, the sale is being heavily opposed by the United States, which is also trying to stop a similar deal between Russia and Turkey. Yeah. All right. Defense deals between Russia and India are currently dominated, um, denominated, slack it, denominated in U.S. dollars. The countries have discussed various ways of bypassing U.S. sanctions, including payment in third uh, currencies like the Singapore dollar. Talks are being conducted between Vi, 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 V Bank and Indian Bank. On the Indian side and Russia's top uh, creditor, Esber S Bank, an option that is now ruled out in, uh, is paying in U.S. dollars to non-sanctioned Russian entities. OK, so that's that's like they, they, they're at the point where they're like, no more, man. And, and hey, man, what do you think is, is that's going to do to the U.S. dollar, man? All right. That's devaluing the dollar way more than, than it already is right now. OK. So this 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 man this this country is on its last legs, man. All right, using inflated currencies and oh man, you the debt that this that that the U.S. is in, they're not even gonna be able to pay that. All right, so what they what what these elites are planning to do is just start a, do a whole reset. You know, crash it all. Like like if you're creating something and it's not coming out right, you know it keeps messing up. You 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 mess it up. You crumble it up, throw it out, and get you know what I mean new material start again. That's what these elites are trying to do. OK, and instead of the um, the paper, they're trying to use the chip, have even more control. It says um, that this option was decided against as it would have opened up a lot of legal and audit issues, especially as defense deals are looked at very closely. No one wanted to take a chance. A top official involved in the talks told the Indian Daily. Okay, so yeah, that's what these, these these elites are planning to do. Okay, and and with all these signs over there, man, when when this thing does happen, it's gonna be it's gonna be so. Hey, these people ain't gonna have no excuse, man. All right, because the signs were there. All right, the writings were written on the wall, warning you of what was to come. We were out here prophesying, warning you of what was to come. All right, these articles come out every day, man. RT News, we constantly putting out videos. Brothers all around the world are constantly uh, uh, pushing out this word. 
All right. There's no excuse to to uh, uh, sit there. Oh, I didn't. I didn't know. It's not that you didn't know. You just didn't care. All right. So now that you're affected. All right. In your affliction. <laughs> all right. That's that's when you know. Hey. See, it doesn't work that way, man. All right. Matter of fact, uh, Proverbs one and twenty. Wisdom crieth without. She uttereth her voice in the streets. How? By 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 way of us us going out there and teaching. Okay, she crieth in the chief place of concourse, in the openings of the gates, in the city she uttereth her words, saying, Now, we go out there on the, on, the, on the highways and byways, which is the chief place of concourse, but we also put out these videos on the internet, okay? Which a lot of people also come are, are, are constantly on the internet, you know? So, uh, especially YouTube. It says, How long, ye simple ones, will ye love simplicity, and the scorners delight in their scorning, and fools hate knowledge? How long? Okay. It says, "Turn you at my reproof. Behold, I will pour out my spirit onto you. I will make my words known onto you." But they don't want that. They don't want to turn at the Lord's reproof, man. We we're, we're we're reproving them right now, warning them. Okay, but they don't want to hear it. It says, "Because I have called and ye refused. I have stretched out my hand and no man regarded." All right. Um, there we go. I'm gonna jump down to verse twenty-eight main point right here then shall they call upon matter of fact verse 27 when your fear cometh as desolation and your destruction cometh as a whirlwind when distress and anguish cometh upon you then shall they call upon me because what they're not going to be in their comfort zone then they're going to be uncomfortable then they're going to be seeking help but i will not answer they shall seek me early but they shall not find me all right and that's going to be your, your recompense all right for 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 you know that's going to be the effect for your cause all right for that for that they hated knowledge and did not choose the fear of the lord and because of that what you 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 know what i mean you're going to have to uh, pay for that okay you're going to have to pay for that man this thing this thing you know this, this is a very serious thing all right and and when when it comes to the point of of life and death and yet and death is in your face then people are going to are going to understand that yo <laughs> man this ain't a joke man <laughs> I need the Lord to deliver me. All right. So, Lord willing, this is uh, edifying and informative to the elect. Once again, all praises, honor, and glory to Tia Hawabashim Yahushai. And until next time, Shalom.